Hey everybody, I'm Sam. This is Cole. This is our Above the Noise newsletter for the month of June. And summer is here. Today is actually summer solstice when we're taping this. The weather is turning. Man, the concerts are flowing. It's just been fun to see the activity and the hustle and bustle around town. So we're pretty stoked for a great summer Absolutely. in the best town in Oregon to have it in. So, uh, Cole, tell us a little bit about what are we seeing in the real estate market right now? Yeah, the market is absolutely heated up as we typically see here in the summer months. Pretty much across the board, all metrics uh, are up. So uh, the average median home price is well up. It's almost to $750,000 for this past month. Um, the number of transactions is considerably up. Uh, the number of building permits issued by the city of Bend is up. Um, average days on market is at the lowest that it's been in almost 11 months. So. There's a lot of activity in the market. There's a lot of competition within the market um, and there's a lot going on. We got a couple really good examples of some buyers and some sellers that we represented over the past couple of weeks that we want to share you guys. Uh, tell us about these buyers. Yeah. So just this last weekend, we had some buyers uh, well qualified, ready to go. Everything was re you know, ready to rock. Got into a situation in Midtown where it was obviously going to be competitive. We were thinking, man, maybe four to five offers is what we were kind of hearing. Turns out there was nine total offers potentially 100K over. Uh, we're talking contingencies waived, cash offers, the whole bit. So it was a really competitive situation, more competitive than we would have even thought. But this is kind of starting to happen more and more for, for our buyers out there right now. And then we have a similar situation on the seller side. Yeah, we were fortunate to list a really neat property in Tumalo last week. Uh, over four days, we ended up with over 20 showings. Um, in the end, we had five offers presented, four of which were cash. We had a lot of negotiating uh, ability for our seller to make sure that we got terms that worked really well so that they were set up uh, to move on and uh, transition out of Central Oregon. So uh, really just kind of painting the picture, there's a lot of activity going on. Uh, the homes that show really well, that are priced really well, um, have a lot of buyer demand. And so I think the key is just, uh, we've, been, we've been talking about preparation ever since uh, the first of the year. And I think we continue to want to make sure that if you're entering the market as a buyer or you're considering selling, that you really are prepared. You have the information and your expectations uh, are clear. Yeah. And none of this information is meant to, to give any fear to you buyers, especially, you know, with the right plan, you, you can absolutely succeed in this market. We can help you help advise you in that. So uh, with that said, we'd like to end just highlighting one of an, an awesome organization here in Bend, Oregon. We're going to uh, be supporting them in this next quarter. So Cole, why don't you tell us a little bit about who they are? Yeah, uh, this next quarter, we are going to be contributing towards Furnish Hope. Uh, Furnish Hope is an incredible organization here locally that helps furnish homes for those in need. Um, hopefully you guys are well connected with this, uh, this organization or have heard of them before. They're doing really, really neat work in Central Oregon. Um, they've absolutely taken off um, and we found uh, it be incredibly rewarding to help come alongside that organization. The work is fulfilling. The work that they're doing is really filling a need that we feel is super important for affordability in Central Oregon and making sure that everyone has uh, a respectable furnished home to live in. So we're excited about that. You can check out furnishhope.com uh, to find some more information about that organization. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll uh, catch you next month.